Okay, morning number three, is it? We did our morning routine, waking up 7.15, running and then jump into the swimming pool. And now we're, it's time for breakfast. Waiting for the coffee to be done and then we'll eat something. And straight after breakfast going to the beach. So, it's so beautiful here, like oh. But every morning fresh food, something hot, something cold. Guys, can you imagine like we got to see banana tree in our hotel. It has bananas but they're green. It has bananas but they're green. It has bananas but they're green. But why are they hanging down somehow? Like that's normal, is it? Yes. Look at this beauty. Ah uh, so cool and there are more here. Let me see. And there are so many on one place, like... Jungle mungle! Flowers, cactuses, everything is so giant here. Look at this cactus. Wow. Huge. We are ready. It's 9.30 in the morning and we are on the way to Playa do Camillo or something like that. It's not far away from us, like it's 12 or 15 minutes max. And we are very excited because it's a really beautiful beach. Ah, today is Saturday. Is it Saturday already? Yes. Oh my gosh, the time is flying. Today is Saturday, so we are going out tonight. Oh, I have to put the GPS, sorry guys. We have to see how it's during the night here. And of course I got so many dresses that I have to wear these dresses somewhere. It's interesting actually that practically the weather is like 24 hours around 30 degrees. During the night 30 degrees, during the day 30 degrees, isn't it? Yes. Like it's pretty similar, like... Uh, so nice! I don't understand like how early you have to wake up to get to the beach and not to find it so busy. I need to say that this place is unbelievable. Surprises every day. a point exactly so we can see and enjoy these like little caves, tunnels and arches. Unbelievable. Good decisions. We were very hungry and wanted to go to the restaurant beside the beach. There was a huge, huge restaurant. And when we came there, um, there was a queue like maybe 10 people waiting 
so we were not sure wait or not but when the lady came and asked us like do you want to wait we were like yeah, yeah we will wait and she was like but you know what you will need your shirt on because i was only in a swimming suit because we just came from the beach and i was like so rude you know she didn't even ask like nicely because the the strange thing here is that the most of the restaurants doesn't work between between three and six o'clock so it's a bit hard if you go on late lunch to find a nice restaurant so we waited like maybe five minutes and I was like oh I didn't like her attitude so let's go somewhere else so we went a little bit further from the beach maybe five minutes well, how long did we drive like five minutes maybe we drove and we find another restaurant probably we are going to pay here half of the price that we would pay there for the same things and it's really quiet and nice so grilled octopus Grill, yeah. nom, nom, nom. and sardinas one beach done we just finished our lunch and we are going to another beach beside the first one this one is called Praia Dona Ana so let's see how it looks like it's five o'clock so it's pretty late so maybe we'll be here only one hour two hours max but it's like around 40 degrees Lagos city center, what is that? It smells no good, huh? Like fish, fishy, no? Just to know what you knew. Aha, so we are going there. If you want to in the bathroom, you can put in the bathroom. Tails? Yeah. <laughs> okay, did you decide what you want? I know, yeah. Let's show, show me. Cool. Good choice, darling. <gasps> oh. Here we are, barefoot. I had to take off my shoes. It's horrible to walk here with the high heels. You have loads of money, darling. Are you rich? That's all I know what I have. <laughs> again, again! See that? <laughs> Shower? Uh huh. Ooh, it is showering on this side because it's wet on the ground. I bet you never even tried to be real. You have to play your own game. 